this is Jerry Payne um, from Bluefish Digital. I'd just like to use this short clip to show you how to edit um, and maintain and view your meta tags on a website. Um, this is an example um, site that we built um, a short while ago. Um, now from Internet Explorer, as you can see I'm using Internet Explorer 8. Um, it's very simple to view our meta tags. Not only can we see the title tag up in the browser title bar up there anyhow as well as the page name that we're on and um, we can also double check using page and then view source and we can see this is what uh, the search engine sees in the browser um, and you just make out here we've got the title tag as you can see that ties in now with what's appearing up in the top of the browser up there also we've got the description um, which appears in search engine results such as Google and also we've got the keywords tag which you know, a lot of people say it's not doesn't carry the importance it used to on Google but still I think it's good practice to fill those in and make them personal per page so you've got your title your description and your keywords meta tags all displaying so they'll all be picked up by the search engine uh, when it indexes the page. Um, now, another window, just going to show once we've logged into the administration panel for a website, and um, we can look. This is within Joomla 1.7. Look within the global configuration, we can see our um, global meta description and our global keywords. These are what will appear um, if there's no. Uh, meta tags overwriting at article or page level. Um, also, the site name is where we've put in the title. Now, again, that will be shown throughout the site, unless, of course, we override it um, at page level. As you can see here, we've opted to include the site name in page titles, um, and that way it will put this title in on every page and then follow it uh, with the article name i.e. in these cases it's home page, um, about us page and so on. Um, meta tags can be controlled at article level. If we go into the article manager, for example, we might want to review the experience alpaca planning permission page. Have a look in there. Um, now over here are metadata options. We can put an overriding meta description in there and keywords, make them specific to the page. And that's it. So that's the short brief lesson for today on meta tags. Thank you.